I'm having a lovely morning so far. I've got my knitting. I've got a special favourite. Granny's over there. How are you feeling, Granny? Lush. <laughs> she drank too much. She's, She's blaming drunk. it on the slow gin, really? not the really bottle and a half of Prosecco she sunk. <laughs> Yeah, a mouthful of slow gin. Yeah, but that's what she's blaming. <laughs> <laughs> All right, just a big I think you want to employ your detective skills. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think you deduce? So I've been trying to watch this since. <laughs> You're doing it, aren't you? Since it's half quiet. past nine. It's a 23 minute video. It's now quarter to 11. <laughs> I've had so many distractions. <laughs> Once I was watching a film called The Dig and it literally took me all day to watch it. The milk exploded on me. My poor hands. <laughs> oh, Bill. Hang on. My phone got splattered. What, what happened? You pushed the... Yeah, I knew. Push the tinfoil in. Yeah, Bill, okay. can you not walk around with milk dripping off your hands onto the carpet? It'll smell cheesy. It was, isn't it? Because Look at that mess I've made. I didn't really vlog yesterday, so I thought I'd have a little chat about it yesterday instead. And then stick this on the video and call it done. <laughs> yesterday, this is Saturday the 4th. Um, I was just doing stuff for, for most of the day, just here and there, and, and then I drove down to Devon, to Paynton, to um, my cousin's house. Uh, it was my uncle's birthday party, and it was like a family Christmas gathering. It was just really nice. I stayed at my cousin's, and uh, I loved it. As I've got older, I've been more aware of that sense of belonging and fitting in. Not because I feel I need to fit in anywhere or anything like that, but just that sense of it being automatic. And um, I said, I spend time with my my uncle and my three cousins and it's like they have to love me <laughs> and but no it's like they don't have to love me just because we're family but they do and I feel it and I and I, lo I love them and whilst you know, not, not, not a single one of us is anything extraordinary. I just think that they are all extraordinary. I just love them all. So uh, my uncle didn't know who was on the guest list. He didn't know all of who was coming. So there were some nice surprises for him when people he was never expecting to see turned up. It was just great. It was really great. He was all choked up and emotional. He used to be quite a hard man, but he's less so now. And what was really nice about the do was staying over at my cousin's, my cousin's home with his lovely wife. Come this way. And uh, waking up this morning and all having breakfast together. And just... Oh! Normally at the weekends, Toby walks the dog, but um, they've been doing, chopping down a, chopping up a tree that came down in the storm last week. Um, I can see the tractor over there with the split on it, but I don't think that they're there. So I think I might have missed them, that's a shame. I was going to film them in action. Yeah, that'll be firewood sorted for the next, goodness knows how many winters. Uh, I'm very fortunate to, um, be able to get our firewood in this way it's the trees falling in the wind farmer needs it tidying up we need to warm the house ideal oh, I don't think they're there that's a shame 
don't think this roll neck's very flattering on my chins. I need to start taking better care of myself. Now is obviously not the best time to have those ideas with all the delicious seasonal food, but I do need to do a better job of looking after myself. No, they're not there, they're gone. Wow, that is a big old tree. They're not even halfway through. Wow. Look, it's come off, it's sheared off from the side. Isn't it? Got a bit of kit.